Everybody should on the page number 15. What we see on the page number 15, computers are used in the banks. Okay, what these computers are you, what these computers are doing in the bank, they are used to check the money. Okay, they help us. These computers help us to check out how much money we have in our account. This thing is mentioned in your book. Okay, and they are also used. These computers are also used in ATM machines. ATM machines are special computers. Why they are special? Because these computers cannot play the videos. These computers cannot play songs. We cannot play games on it, but we can only check our account. We can only take money from the ATM machines. The full form of ATM is automatic teller machine. This machine counts the currency. This machine automatically counts the currency. That's why its name is automatic teller machine. We see that thing, okay? It's mentioned in the book. There are so many other things that computer can do in the bank, but we will only see the things which are mentioned in the book, okay? So they help us, the bank persons, the person, those who are doing the job inside the banks or the people, when they go to bank, then the computer helps them to find out that how much money they have in their bank account. Okay, on the page number 16, computers are also used at airports and railway stations. Computers are also used at airports and railway stations. Okay, they are used for the scanner. The scanner you see, the scanner you see, the scanner you see on the airport uh, is a computer, but it's a special kind of computer we or that those persons cannot play we or those persons those who are at the airport they cannot play games on that computer they cannot play songs on that computer they cannot watch cartoons on that computer because they are using this computer for the scanning if you see if you see on the in the picture in the picture when you go to airport you show your tickets to the ticket counter what they check they can check it on the computer. That's whether this ticket is there or not. So they are using the computer. Okay. You can see which, air, which plane is landed or which is not. So all the boards, all the electronic boards on the airports are connected with the computers. All the ticketing system is connected with the computers so that they can check. So computers are used at, at airport and at railway station. So they are used at airport and at railway station they are used to book and issue tickets they are using who are using who who is using the computer at airport the persons those who are doing jobs at the airport they are using to book and issue tickets with the help of computer so computers are used to book and issue tickets to the passengers so they are used to book book the tickets from the airport so that's why computers are using at the yes, yes. airport that's why computers are using at the airport or the There's railway the station they are that's why they are using at the airport or at the railway station yes abdul rahman al wasil yes please yes sir what do you want to say It's not clear what are you saying? Okay, everyone everyone should yes. listen. Yes. When I ask yes. you a question, then you should raise the hand. And if you have any question, then you can ask anything. If you want to share anything, then kindly don't raise the hand now. Okay? Why? Because we have to cover the part of the lesson. Okay? If you have any question, then when I unmute you, ask question. Okay? But if you want to say any answer, and I didn't ask the answer for this, then kindly don't raise the hand. Always raise the hand if you want to ask anything. Or if you have any question, then you raise the hand. Otherwise, don't raise the hand. Okay? Okay, Abdullah Hisham. Yes, Abdullah Hisham, what is your question, please? Abdullah Hisham, I am waiting. The whole class is waiting for you, Abdullah. You raise the hand. 
Okay. Arish, yes, Arish, what is your question? Arish, what is your question? You raise the hand. Not. Yes, sir. What is your question? You raise the hand. What is your question? Okay. Ahmad, Ahmad Muhammad. Yes, Ahmad Muhammad. What is your question? Ahmad Muhammad, you raise the hand. What is your question, please? Say your question, please. Yes, please. Okay. Abdul Rahman Atif. Yes, Abdul Rahman Atif, you raise the hand. What is your question? Abdul Rahman Atif. Kindly speak on your turn. Abdul Rahman Atif. Yes. What is your question, Abdul Rahman Atif? There is computer and press of that. What are you saying? What are you saying? Your voice is not coming, Abdul Rahman. Your mic is showing that you are saying something, but your voice is not coming over. There is computer and Sorry, computer is what? Okay. Okay. Now, okay. Uh, it's Alam Lag. Okay. Yes, Alam Lag. What is your question? Alam Lag. What is your question? You raise the hand, please. Say something, please. Abdul Rahman Al Wasir. Yes. What is your question? Policeman. Yes. What is your question? Inside computer. Inside computer what? Police cars. No, what is your question? Cars. What is your question? Inside the, inside the car police, inside the computer. No, it's not audible. Okay. Okay. Hamza Al Sayyid. Hamza Al Sayyid. Yes. Kindly don't raise hand. Those students who raise hand and I call them and you didn't answer. Kindly don't raise hand again. Okay. If you don't have any question, then don't, don't raise the hand. Okay. I see some of the students. I call them and they are not saying anything and raise the hand again. Okay. I see some of the names. Yes. Yes, Hamza Al Sayyid. Everybody should listen. If you have any question, you can raise the hand. If you have question, then raise the hand. Because if you share anything, if I ask you any question, then for the answer, you can raise hand. But if you have no question and I don't ask any question, then kindly don't raise the hand, please. Okay. So computers are used at the airport or the railway station to book the ticket and to print the ticket. When you book the ticket on the railway station or the airport, they will give you the ticket from their machine by the printing. So they use the computer for the printing to issue and by booking the tickets. That's why they are using the computer. Okay. Then afterwards, afterwards what we have, then they are using it for booking and issue tickets. If you see the picture on your computer screen, I will may I put this picture for you. If you see, this is the picture of a railway station. This is the picture of a European railway station. So many people are sitting there. So if you see, there is an ATM. There is a ticket counter. There is an ATM. There is a ticket counter. And people are using them. And people are using them. Ticket counter is there. And ATM is also there. Where is the ATM? Let me show you. Where is the ATM? Here it is. The person is using the ATM. The person in the box is showing the ATM. And then there's a ticket counter. They are using the computer as a ticket counter. So they are used. Computers are used at railway station and at airport. Okay. Yes, Abdul Rahman Al Wasil. Yes, what is it? Use machine. Use machine. 
Is this your question, Abdul Rahman? It's not a question. It is not a question. Kindly ask me a question. If you have any question, then raise the hand, please. Okay. Okay. Now, Abdul Rahman Atif. Abdul Rahman Atif, yes. What happened, Abdul Rahman Atif? What is your question, please? There is computer in this office. It's used in the office. Okay. So, now. Now, let me clear the screen first. Then, we will move to next thing. Now, they are also used to check passengers. Computers are also used to check passenger. There are some special computers. I told you in the start that it is used for security. See, I draw a box. It's a security computer. There is a scanner. It's a scanner. This scanner is connected with the computer. Okay. This scanner connected with the computer and these computers are used to check the passengers. These computers are used to check the passengers. These computers are used to check the passengers that what they have in their luggage. What they have in their luggage, they are used, they, they are using this computer for scanning. So in this way, they are using it. What we see, we see that computers are used in the bank to check the money, how much money we have in our bank. And there are some special computers. They are ATM. Okay, it's an automatic teller machine. I'm just giving you the review. We see this in the whole period. Okay, automatic teller machine gives us a money from our account. And we see computers are also used as airport and at the railway station. So what they are doing, they are doing by issuing the tickets and by booking the tickets. They are doing their job by issuing and booking the tickets, computers are doing their job on the airport or the railway station by issuing and booking tickets on the airports or the railway station. They are also used to check passengers. Means for the security, they are also using the computers for the security and by scanning. So they are using a scanners. These are the special computers. Means they cannot play games. They cannot watch videos. They cannot watch or uh, listen songs on the on those computers why because they are using it on the airport or on the railway station now everyone should has to open the worksheet everyone should has to open the worksheet okay there is everyone should has to open the worksheet there's a worksheet in the class era everyone should has to open the worksheet everybody should has to open the worksheet from the class era. Everybody should have to open the worksheet from the class era. We will do the worksheet. It's there. Okay. Everybody open the worksheet. Say yes or no. Everybody open the worksheet. Say yes or no. Sir, I have a question. Okay, Emma, okay, okay, let me ask. Everybody should open the worksheet. Let me, uh, let me ask a question. Let me take a question from Ahmad Mohammed. Yes, yes, Ahmad Mohammed, what is your question? Yes. Question is in the bank, we can, we can put the cards and make and uh, put out the money and put it in the cart, go off and the money inside the car. So what is your question? What is your question? My question is, 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 my question is, is, is in the bank we can put the cart and, and put out and the money, uh, go out and put it again money and, and the cart go out and, and in the money inside the care it is okay, correct okay okay let me tell you wait Ahmad Muhammad. yes 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 we can put money in the atm and we can also take it okay we can put the money but there are some atms available what they can do what they can do they can take money first you have to open the your account on the atm and then you have to put the money they can deposit the money in your account okay and yes. they can also give you the money yes. on yes. your request Only if you want to take out the money they can also give you the money from your account from your bank account and you can also put money in your bank account by the atm but they are the specific specific or the special atms which can take money from you 
okay normal atms will only give you the money okay from your bank account okay so everyone open the worksheet everyone open the worksheet everyone open the worksheet say yes or no everybody open the worksheet okay now now the first question first question of the worksheet is saying what is the first question of worksheet is saying what is the first question uh, worksheet is saying the question is saying take the activities take the activities that a computer can help in doing mark other activities with an cross so we have to do the tick and a cross we have to put the tick and a cross on the activity we have to put the tick and a cross on the activity that computer can help us to do okay the first question the first thing is there okay the first thing is this the person is singing the person is listening a song the person is listening a song yes we can listen the songs on the computer it's true computer can help us to listen songs yes it's true computer can help us to listen song it's true yes we can do it put a tick on it everybody should has to put a tick on it everybody put tick on this picture everybody put tick on this picture now there is a picture number 2 the picture number 2 is about singing the person is singing a song can computer help us in the singing no computer cannot help us in singing because we can sing from our mouth okay so put a cross on the picture put a cross on the picture put a cross on the picture b so on the picture a person can listen songs yes computer can help us to do it okay but computer cannot help us in singing okay now we are going towards the picture number c the picture number c is saying that can computer help us in playing cricket can can computer help us in playing cricket can computer is help us in playing physical games they are talking about physical games the games we play outside the games we play outside the home is basically uh, the physical games so are they help us no computer cannot help us in physical games but computer only game help us in the computer games okay computer help us in computer help us in playing computer games only but we cannot play the physical game we cannot play football we cannot play the real football on the computer we can only play the game so put a cross on the picture it will not help in playing the real game on the computer okay so can we do calculation on the computer can we do calculation on the computer yes because computer can do calculation everybody should have to put the tick on the d so the first thing is singing computer can help uh, sorry the first thing is listening the computer can help in listening yes it's true put a tick on the picture the picture number b is saying can computer can help in singing no can computer helps in playing the real games no computer cannot helps in real games computer can only play the virtual games which we can see we cannot play the real game on the computer we cannot play the real football we cannot play the real cricket on the computer the picture d is saying can computer help in calculation yes put a tick on the picture put a tick on the picture so let me clear the screen now we are moving towards the next we are moving towards the next what is the next picture is saying the next picture is saying okay the picture number e is computer helps us in cooking is computer helps us in cooking no computer never helps in cooking computer cannot do our help in cooking put a cross on that picture put a cross on that picture put a cross on that picture e they will not help us okay now in the next there is a f okay what this is doing the person is making a drawing can computer helps us in drawing yes computer helps us in drawing so put a tick on the f put a tick on the f computer can helps us in drawing computer can helps us in drawing put a tick on it so on the e put a cross on the f put a 
Tick. Okay. Now we are moving to the next. Take the correct way to sit while using the computer. There is a picture which shows you that which is the correct position to sit while using the keyboard. So the the correct way, the correct way to sit is this. You have to be sit straight. You have to be sit straight because if you sit in this way, if you sit in this way, so you will get a back ache. Okay, you will get a pain in your back. You will get a pain in your back for after some time. Why? Because this position is not correct for your back. So you have to take. Uh, you have to take the first picture. You have to sit like this. Okay, let me make it in the uh, another color. Okay, so you have to sit like this. The position which I put in the box of green color, you have to sit like this because in this way, your back will be relaxed while sitting or typing. Okay, while using the keyboard or by sitting on the computer table or computer chair or by using the keyboard, you have to sit like this. Okay, so this is the correct way to sit on the computer chair while using computer. Okay, so these are the so these are the answers for the worksheet. So there is a one homework for you. Let me share the homework with you. There is a one homework for you on the page number fifteen. There is a picture on the page number fifteen. You have to join the dots. You have to join the dots and then you have to color the ATM machine. When you join the dot, what happened? When you join the dots, what happened? It, uh, you will make the ATM machine with the help of dots. When you join the dots, it, ATM machine will be made and you have to color the ATM machine. And you have to color the ATM machine. And you have to color the ATM machine. And after coloring it, you have to send me the picture on the mail. So it's your homework. And along with it, you have a one mini assignment. It's a mini assignment. Very small assignment is there okay, for you in the core, core class era. It's available in the class era uh, in assignment section. So there is one homework for you. You have to draw the picture, join the dots, color the picture, and then you have to do the assignment. So this is it. Yes, Abdul Rahman Vasil. Abdul Rahman Al Wasil. Yes. Otherwise, I will give. In the machine, Joe. Joe's machine, machine. In the computer, Mummy. Joe's machine, machine. Okay, okay, okay. So now the period is over. We will meet in the next class. We will meet in the next class.